Good evening and welcome to Procon's YouTube channel. I am Andrew Brooks. This video will briefly explain the difference between the beam detailing and the subframe strip design links. If you've ever used Sumo's design links, you will have noticed that there are two options that export information to continuous beam. That is the beam detailing and the subframe strip design links. Let's take a look at both to compare the two options. The beam detailing design link is meant for beam elements, that is, monolithic beams or beams with a concrete section. It is important to note that in this case, the results that you view in continuous beam are directly imported from Sumo. The inputs are grayed out because continuous beam doesn't do the calculation when the beam detailing design link is used. You can view the results by looking at the Frame Results tab. The X moments, as example, are shown in Continuous Beam and compared with Sumo. The subframe design link exports a Sumo element called a subframe strip to Continuous Beam. The subframe takes the geometry and the loading from Sumo and loads it into Continuous Beam. Notice that Continuous Beam does the analysis when this design link is used. There are no frame results tabs in this case. In fact, a Sumo analysis isn't even necessary to access this design link. This is particularly useful when doing a flat slab design. Continuous Beam allows for the consideration of column and middle strips which divide the applied moments into re the required percentages according to a specific code. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. For more tips and tricks, please remember to subscribe to our channel.